What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Grady. I listen to country music and react to it because not many people do that on YouTube and I enjoy doing it, okay? And I like talking about music and I think this is the best medium to do it in and no one talks about country music in a critical way on YouTube except maybe Spectrum Pulse and a couple others, but trying to build the community a little bit here and uh, y'all seem to like it and I seem to enjoy doing it, so I'm gonna keep doing it. Today, I'm checking out Lee Bryce's new single, Boy. Lee Bryce can be a real hit and miss. You know, he has songs like I Drive Your Truck, which even though it mentions truck, is a gorgeous song about how you mourn someone that has died. And then he has songs like Drinking Class, where he just literally named the days of the week. <laughs> um, and then is like, I belong to the drinking class. Uh, I, I can really like him and really dislike him. There's a song, Boy, I've heard a lot about it. It seems to be really taking off, so... Maybe it's connecting with people. I don't know a thing about it, and I'm going to listen to it right now. It has a music video out, so I'm going to check out the music video and tell you what I think. So we got him alone in a house in slow-mo, opening a door. This seems sad. Is this sad? Is this another death song? Boy, you're going to know it all. You'll think you're ten feet tall. I told you to call her too. <laughs> I wish you could burn it down. Mm, I love this. You're gonna love 17. You'll do some stupid. This reminds me of Letter to Me by Brad Paisley. You're gonna drop the ball, hit the wall, and break some hearts like life. Part of you will always be. Boy, <laughs> you gonna be so stubborn? No, oh, you weren't built for backing down. There'll be a small town night, and you fall from the sky blue eyes. You think you're a man and not a boy. You wanna drive the kids and throw a punch? I love this. You're a part of me. I wonder if I, th I bet these are his real sons. It's so beautiful. I thought he was singing to his younger self, but I think he's singing to his sons. Oh, and that's his dad. <laughs> oh man, between this and Zach Brown's My Old Man, we've got like all the generations being represented right now. You have a boy. <laughs> oh man, no. oh. I love the final chorus of a good country song. Where it takes that one little twist. And going to the next generation is, uh, oh, that's all we get? I want to live in this song for like six more minutes. It ends already? What the heck? Wow. Again, not crying, just teary-eyed. <laughs> I don't care if y'all think I'm crying. I cry very easily when I listen to things that I like, um, and I'm moved by it. And man, Lee Bryce, despite coming in with some skepticism, that immediately moved me. The way it's produced is just beautiful. That first, boy, like it's just so clear. It says, boy, it's, it's impersonal in that first word, and then it flips it immediately and becomes so deeply personal. I think that is a gorgeous, gorgeous song. It resonated with me for a lot of reasons. One, you can just feel Lee Bryce's care for the subject matter in it. It's universal without being hackneyed. There's not that many images in the song that I'm tired of hearing, even like the driving away when you're moving out of home. I can't think of that many songs that use that image. Um, I think of There Goes My Life by Kenny Chesney. I think it's really cool to hear a parent reflect on his son growing up and I'm gonna get a little, there's gonna be like touches of political feeling in this. Deal with it, it's my channel. It's cool to hear a song that is excite, a father excited about a boy being a boy. Sometimes, and I'm not sitting here saying I'm a victim, I'm not a victim. It can feel as a guy that right now society doesn't want you to be much of a man. It doesn't want you to be adventurous, it doesn't want you to get in trouble, it doesn't want you to be reckless. and. Whether you want to, whatever you want to say, that's a piece that's inherent to boyhood. I love that Lee Bryce is embracing the idea that his kid's going to be a little bit reckless, a little bit of a heartbreaker, a little bit misguided, a little bit cocky, and ultimately wise, uh, like he is when he has his own boy. Uh, there's an aspect of this, a family through line, a recommendation of becoming a father that is 
never heralded in society, at least as I hear it. I feel like I'm never, t I feel like in general, I'm told that my desire to, to be a father, to be a man, to procreate, that those are all sort of toxic in some way. This idea of toxic masculinity is frustrating. And the idea that a boy should be a boy uh, without arguing it in that sort of aggressive manner, but just an excitement that you have a boy. It felt sort of revolutionary and cool to me in a weird way. I'm surprised by my own reaction to it. And this is me thinking out loud. So if you're like, well, that's a psycho reaction. Again, I don't care. <laughs> um, you're here watching. And maybe I'm feeling preemptively self-defensive for no reason. That's a really lovely song. It's so simple and it's so pretty. And there is substance in country music. And that final chorus when it goes to his boy having his own boy. Oof. That is the best kind of emotional manipulation. I'll take it. I love that song. And Lee Bryce continues to move in and out of my good graces, but who cares? I hope that song blows up, and I think it will, because it certainly tugs on the heartstrings. I, I think fatherhood and parental identity is important to every single person on earth. Uh, and if you have, you know, that's why daddy issues are a thing that everyone has, because everyone wants their dad's approval, and to hear a dad approving of his son and excited about his son, that's moving. On this one, I'm a big Lee Bryce fan, and there might be another parking lot party or drinking glass <laughs> around the corner, but at least we have boy, you know? So if you like this video, if you like this uh, channel, give it a like, hit subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys soon with another reaction. And I hope it's as good as this song.